So, you want to know how I achieved this look, right? If you do, just make sure you keep watching. I first start off with freshly blowed out hair because for me, it's much easier to braid my hair this way. After parting my hair in two, I section the front part of my hair, starting from the top and going down right above my ear. Next, I take a piece out of this part, making it into a square. Well, kind of a square. So when you're done sectioning both sides, you will start braiding. But of course, make sure your hair is free from tangle to avoid breakage. You start braiding from the top of your head going backwards, making sure that the palms of your hands lays flat on your head. This way, your hair also lays flat on your scalp. Okay, so let me slow down the process. When braiding, keep in mind you only pick up hair in the middle section. This helps in keeping all three sections even in size. I know if you're not used to doing this, it might be hard at the beginning, so don't stress about how the hair is looking, but just make sure you keep practicing because afterwards you will get better at this. And when you're done braiding, you secure the braids with a bobby pin. Okay, so it's time to clip in the extensions. You start off with the first clip in at the nape of your neck right below the braids. Keeping in mind, if you're doing it this way, you won't be able to clip into the braids. So you want to make sure that the two clip ins on the end of the extensions are well secured. And then you just work your way up. You will use a little less than two bundles of hair for this look. Now that you've reached the top part of your head, you want to clip in the extensions in a circle motion. Like half a circle, I guess. But when you're putting the last piece, clip the two ends of the extensions right on the side and not in a circle form. So keep it behind the line where you've sectioned your hair. This way the clip-ins don't show on the front part of your head. Now that you're done, it's time to blend in the hair. I normally start by laying down the front part with some gel. You do want to do your makeup after doing this because if the headband doesn't stretch enough, you will be struggling like me right here. So when I'm done struggling, I just brush my hair down and then put the headband over my head. But of course, you do need to blend your hair with the extensions. So what I do, I just wet my hair a little bit and then adding a little styling product to blend my hair with the extensions. And of course, you know me, I always want to fix my edges. So you guys know this is optional. And this is the final look. I rocked this for two days, sleeping with the satin headband from her given hair. And on the third day, I removed the clip-ins to give my hair a break. The next morning, I just clipped the hair back in and I'm good to go. So if you liked the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. All the information about the hair and headband I use will be down in the description box below. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you back on my next video. Bye.